Yo! What is up, Team GDP Yoga? Dot com. It is me, it is me, it is Michael D. Mullins here on my Facebook page or my Team DDP Yoga profile page. Uh, just checking in. Haven't put up a video blog in a little while. It hasn't been by design. Um, just got caught up in some things and didn't have a chance to post a blog or anything recently. Um, but I am doing awesome. Better than ever, actually. Um, I gotta tell you my my journey so far. Um, when I've I've been trying to do this gluten free thing. I de desperately wanted it deep down inside, but I had trouble getting started. I had trouble, you know, staying gluten free. Um, I'd go on for a little bit and then off for a little bit and then on for a little bit and then off for a little bit, and it just wasn't clicking with me. And I finally realized uh, what my biggest problem is trying to go gluten free is that I was setting myself up for failure instead of success. Now, by that I meant I still had a cupboard full of Triscuits and Doritos and all this crap. I necessarily, you know, and when you're in a pinch and you need something quick and you need something fast, you go into your cupboard and that's, Doritos are pretty tasty. You know, all this stuff. So it really clicked for me one time and I decided I'm going to do this for real. And I went in my cupboard and I threw everything that wasn't gluten free away. Um, and I went and shopped all gluten free and got all the necessities that I needed to be gluten free, which is setting myself up for success rather than failure. And since I've done that, I've been over two and a half months uh, completely 100% gluten free not even falling off like a little bit and it's shown exponentially um just i had a long stagnant uh time where i was not losing weight i was killing the workouts but i wasn't dropping the pounds and since i've gone gluten free completely 100 percent, i have consistently lost every single week i know you're not supposed to weigh yourself every week but i'm kind of doing my own kind of thing there in the past month i've lost another nine pounds which I'm pretty excited about. Um, definitely kickstarted the weight loss again. Um, and so if you guys are having trouble just staying gluten free and just getting there and just staying there, if you're on and off, off and on, my biggest advice for you, and Dallas will tell you this too, um, set yourself up for success, not failure. Give yourself the tools you need to be successful and don't have that crap in your cupboard. Don't have that stuff just staring at you in the face every time you open up your your uh your your cupboard um so that would be my biggest advice to you and uh, another thing i want to talk to you guys about i've saw i've seen a lot of guys uh posting recently i saw andy post something nolan post something whether they're having illnesses or sicknesses or whatever and uh, i love that andy despite being sick still checked in every single day with uh ddp yoga um the biggest thing and i see this a lot um let's just call a spade a spade here um, people come, people go. We've, I've seen this, I've been doing this since March, and I've seen that. People come, people go, people come, people go. It's the, anything in life, you know, any program, anything you're going to do, you're going to have some people that stay, and some people that, you know, come and go, come and go. And what I've noticed, uh, quite a bit from the people who go is they start to have a little bit of a rut. They start to have a bad week or a bad couple weeks. And they disappear for that couple weeks. Then they come back once or twice. And then they disappear. And then they're just gone for good. So my advice, and that's the thing. You you don't want to disappear when you're having a bad week or a bad couple weeks or, or whatnot. That's when you need the most support. That's when you need to stay here the most. You don't want to disappear if you're having a bad week you want to be on the site more you want to be contacting dallas through his facebook page or the people on team ddp yoga to pump you up and lift you up and get you back where you need to be the last thing you need to do is disappear and that usually ends up being the downfall for people that do disappear is they just leave for a couple weeks because they're embarrassed or they don't want to face the fact in themselves that they've had a bad couple weeks, whether it be uh, eating wise or DDP yoga or whatever it may be. Uh, but people need to realize that when they're having a tough time, that's when you need the community the most. That's when you need to be around so we can 
engulf you with support and love and motivation and uh, just positivity to get you back to where you need to be. So let me just tell you this, when you're doing bad, why would you disappear? That's when you need us the most. Come back. Stay with us. Even if you're not working out, just get on the side every day. Tell people what your problem is. Tell people you're not doing well. So we can surround you with the positivity and support you need to do well. That's just what you have to do to be successful. That was my big thing. Just, I've had times where I've not worked out for a week. Or I've had bad weeks or bad months or whatnot. But the big thing is just keep coming back. I saw a great quote from Dallas on his Facebook page uh, about a month ago, I think it was. It said, are you sick of starting over? Then stop quitting. And that was my big thing. Whether I'm doing bad, good, awesome, satisfactory, moderate, just keep coming back. And show up every day. And just have that mindset, whether you do it or not, that you're going to do it. And just do it. It's, it's the biggest thing you can do for yourself is consistency. I... By telling people, everyone I know I was doing DDP yoga and I was going to change, that gave myself an accountability factor. Because people ask me about it every time they see me. How's the DDP yoga going? How's the, how's the weight loss going? And I tell them. And that accountability has kept me keep coming forward. So definitely check in every day or every other day or as soon as, as much as you possibly can. Because that accountability of getting to know everybody and when you step away, people ask me where you are. That's going to keep you coming back. And don't quit. Just keep coming back every single day. All right. Uh, that's about it for me. Um, I just finished a killer strength builder workout a few minutes ago. Uh, felt great. And then I hopped in a warm bath and just soaked my muscles a little bit. But uh, like I said, nine pounds down this month. I'm going to have my day. I don't even know what day it is. Like eight month picture, I think it is. Uh, on the 17th of this month. So I'm excited about unveiling those because I've definitely seen a difference in the past month. Um, and I'm excited. I hope you guys are doing well. And just, if you take anything from what I said, if you guys are having a tough time, don't disappear. Please, please, please don't disappear because that's when you need the support the most. I hope you guys are doing well. Keep on keeping on. Peace out. Rock out. And bang. Woo!